Carrie Lynn, Chloe, and her fiance are struggling to find a rental home for their three kids and 60 pound dog. We sold our house in two weeks, which we weren't expecting. So then we started searching for a house to rent for like about two months ago, I would say. And the problem that we found is that there's not very many places that will allow dogs or pets in general. With a flexible budget and great references, the couple didn't think it would be difficult to find a place. Right off the bat when I reply to an ad, I tell them that I do have references, that we do have employment and anything else that they would want to know. Carrie Lynn Chloe isn't the only pet owner feeling overlooked. In a Castanet Facebook post, many Kamloops renters expressed the same frustration. And according to the Tenant Resources and Advisory Center, this is a province-wide problem. British Columbia is a jurisdiction that allows landlords to say, we won't rent to you if you have a pet. Um, Ontario, for example, says the opposite, says that landlords cannot prohibit or, uh, pets. So when the province did the Rental Housing Task Force, sent them out to listen to British Columbians about their issues with rental housing, the number one issue they heard about was tenants asking for uh, the government to change the rules to make sure people weren't sort of discriminated against in their housing choices um, be just because they have a pet. So the ball is in the provincial government's court, but if Carrie Lynn Chloe's family did does not find a home by November 27th, they'll have nowhere to go. I just want somewhere to live. It's what? hard. For Castanet Camloops, I'm Amanda Lena Letario. Mm -hmm.